October is considered the official start of the flu season, but some local doctors say they're already seeing some cases. Anieli Ruiz spoke with one local physician who told us what to expect from the flu season and how to protect yourself from it. Flu season doesn't start on a certain day, but there's one sure way you can tell when it's begun. That's when the phones start ringing at doctor's offices. Last year we had a, a later flu season and it kind of ran later. So depending on the year, um, we can see the flu season start at different times. Here at Physicians Premier, patients have already come in with flu symptoms. Uh, usually the flu-like symptoms, you know, typical flu-like symptoms, runny nose, body aches, fever, uh, just generalized malaise and not feeling well. So some doctors are putting out this advice. Get the flu shot now before the official season starts. They also have advice on what sort of flu protection you could get. Not to use the nasal vaccine, they're not recommending that, so they're recommending injectable versions of the vaccine, um, and they have tailored it to try and cover what they anticipate they will see this year. So what do doctors expect for this season? Say this year so far, we're anticipating a typical year. But nevertheless, they hope everyone takes precautions necessary to keep the flu contained. A good way to prevent the flu is to use good hand washing technique, cover your cough, um, you know, just if you are sick, try not to be out in public, try not to spread your germs. Anayeli Ruiz, Chris 6 News. The flu season doesn't officially start until October, so the local health department doesn't have a count on cases since they haven't started tracking them.